Uh, we're gonna start this show off right with a very talented young lady by the name of Chloe J. So I need everybody to put your hands together for Chloe J.
one of the things that's very important about our organization is that she comes from the same side of the tracks that a lot of these young people do. I was an at-risk girl growing up. I was raped multiple times before I turned 16. During that time, I was lost. I had my daughter five days after my 15th birthday. My mom didn't have the best job of I don't know how she did. I didn't really understand how to communicate, and someone believed in me, and things are changing. That's what I kind of want to do with these girls. What Nicola is doing makes a big difference in these girls' lives. It's like a great experience of how you can like overcome what has happened. Girls inspiring girls. You know that empowerment from another girl is like really, really helpful. We have 21 cities for this tour. I'm bringing who's who of the women community in these cities in front of these girls. There's a panel of speakers, but they also do breakout workshops. We learned about self-esteem. We did um, vision boards on like daily motivation. If you're having a bad day, you can write things that can help you have a better day. In every city, I sponsor 50 to 100 girls who are in group homes, girls who are arrested from the sex trade, girls who are homeless, sometimes girls who are pregnant. She gives them an opportunity to showcase their talent. For some of these girls, girls who run stories has been life changing. My goal is to make sure the girls have a good time. They just need love. The life is sweet. Just everything that I'm doing is worth it when I see their faces. My mother is a woman of work because she is selfless. Nicola is very supportive. She's been through a lot and she is very strong and powerful. I think it's a great thing what she's done and it's amazing. She can change her life. I'm living proof. She changed my life. If we know how much power we really possess, there's no stopping us.
So if you haven't watched the movie, make sure you watch it and then share it with someone. It is called Giving Hope. It's streaming, streaming right now. And some of her awards, y'all, y'all ready? Because it's a lot. <laughs> Top 23 of 2023 winners of the World Global Magazine. Prestigious congressional recognition from, from Congressman Sheila Jackson Lee. Proclamation Day, March 26, 2023, is Nicola Mitchell Day in the city of Atlanta. I was like, they gave you a whole day? <laughs> Executive producer for Lifetime Movie Networks, the Presidential Lifetime Achievement Award. A Doctrine of Philosophy and Humanitarianism, the People's Uprising Woman of the Year Award, Civility for the Girl Child Initiative Honoree, George H. W. Bush's Daily Points of Light Award, Forbes Lists as Change Maker, L'Oreal's Paris Woman, I told y'all to y'all, L'Oreal's Paris Woman of Worth, of the Year, Women of Distinction Award, Black Enterprise, one of the five to follow worthy bloggers to watch. And then, check this out, y'all. So she don't have one city of proclamation, but these are the several cities that she got proclamation on. The city of Atlanta, Charleston, Houston, the Mayor's Office of Indianapolis and Indiana, and the Mayor's Office of Las Vegas, Nevada, her hometown. Y'all that are amazing and all the men and women 
that put this event on for all of these girls to help me make this 38,000 girls. So on your on the table, there are QR codes. Please donate something. For us to allow 250 girls to come for free, we need something. It's $100,000 for 23 cities, but as of now, we have 25 cities. So we need more money, y'all. <laughs> but that's why we're here. We're, gonna, we're here to donate. We got some raffle prizes. We have a fashion show. We got performers. We got food. You got a VIP. Thank you, Tito's. You guys get to drink for free. If you didn't get a VIP, then you guys can buy a ticket for $10. There's raffle baskets that'll be raffled for $10. And I just want you guys to have a good time. I'm going to turn it back over to our great DJ, DJ FDS. And y'all.